Okay. Fantastic episode. To see how Shion truly feels, he just wanted Will to look at him. And when you look back, it doesn't look... I mean, he did bully him. But when he burnt the note and turned him around to make him his subordinate, I don't think he planned on bully him, bullying him at that point. It actually seemed like he wanted to, in a way, protect him. But like, just like Will, he, he wanted to be seen. Just like Will wanted to. And Will finally understood that and acknowledged it. I knew it was going to end in like maybe a, a, a tie. But to see that the girl had stopped him and that she had beat that clone. So let us know how good she is. And it also helped to let us know that she's not just going to be there to be there that her title in the garden we didn't get to see everything but you already knew she was skillful with the sword she was giving will and the goblet but this really this showed that yeah she's gonna be really important and strong but also the ice dude was crazy too and the wind dude hold on a second <clears throat> yeah sorry for the interruption but like I was saying, I think that Shion and Will will have a better relationship after this. And it's like a three-way, actually four-way, like a square. Because Will likes his friend that's in the tower. And his other friend likes him. And then Sion likes her. Like a whole square relationship. Not love triangle, love square. But also, I was surprised to see that uh, the elf dude didn't make it to the arena after he defeating the Shion clone. I mean, the uh, William clone. But I guess he probably was far too far away, but it showed that he's pretty skillful too because it didn't take him long to do it. But I'm guessing he's not going to show up in enough time to interrupt Will and William's fight. Maybe. But also, you could tell that animation in the woods that that person that's, uh, I forget who it is, worked on Black Clover. I was pre I'm pretty sure I heard that and mentioned before that someone that worked on Black Clover is on working on this show. And with the wood, that scene in the woods, I'm like, yeah, that was really evident. And they were, with time, you can see what they could do with time now. I think the team working on this would, would be great yeah, to work on Black Clover, but I also think that Periot will do a fantastic job when it comes back because of how the work they was able to do on the movie when given the time shows what could be done. But it's just the colors and the animation in this episode were so nice too. How consistent it's been. And the, the, all the shading. But it was a really great episode and I really enjoyed the fight. And to see how Sion, it was like I was saying, he has definitely gotten better. And people are seeing yeah, he messed up when he did this fight and was getting points deducted and people was talking about him being in fourth. But then you got the one guy who was like, this place is a good place to see what people are truly capable of because he wasn't like being brought up with the uh, main three students that everyone is thinking about. But them just being amazed by him being able to use a guardian and spell at the same time shows that he's truly has grown stronger and truly puts in the work. And part of that is Will's, in a way, influence or being there. And, and he's going to be scouted for the fire goddess in the tower, evidently, because of what he's shown here. So I can't wait for the next episode where Will fights uh, this dude finally. And you can tell this dude is definitely not you no know, pushover. 
from the previous episode, yeah, Will had that stern look and broke out that ice and stuff. But with this episode, you can see we didn't get a lot of it, but you can see, tell with the level of skill he had to make those clones and people would not know that this isn't going to be easy. And I like that. And I also like, like that uh, Sion didn't get, like, Will didn't beat him or anything. Even he was trying not to fight him, but when he's actually getting there, just before they connected with their last things, you know, the friend stopped. And now she's stopping Sion from even fighting him further. It's like, Will, you go on ahead. They was not expecting him to be there at that end, but all in all, fantastic. They did a great job with this episode. Can't wait for next week.